On December 3, 2024, Cyprus received its first batch of the Israeli Barak MX surface-to-air missile systems, marking a significant step in the country's defense modernization efforts. This procurement, part of a broader plan to enhance the island's defense infrastructure, was initiated by the government of President Nikos Anastasiadis in October 2021 and continued under the administration of his successor, President Christodoulidis. The Barak MX systems will play a key role in upgrading Cyprus's air defense capabilities, replacing aging Cold War era systems and bolstering the country's ability to counter a wide range of aerial threats. The decision to acquire the Barak MX missile systems was driven by the system's advanced capabilities. These include a vertical launch system, sophisticated radar integration, and compatibility with Cyprus's existing air defense platforms. Initially, negotiations centered on Israel's Iron Dome system, but the Barak MX was chosen for its broader operational range and ability to integrate seamlessly with existing equipment, such as the Russian-made Buk M1-2 and Tor M1 systems already in use by the Cypriot National Guard. The Barak MX offers a more versatile and powerful solution for Cyprus's defense needs. The missile system is designed to intercept a wide array of aerial threats, including drones, fighter jets, ballistic missiles, cruise missiles, and helicopters. It provides extended range coverage, with missile variants that offer up to 150 kilometers of reach. Each fire unit typically accommodates eight missiles, and the system's advanced radar allows for the effective engagement of multiple targets across different directions. The Barak MX procurement is part of Cyprus's wider strategy to modernize its military forces. In addition to the air defense upgrade, the National Guard is also replacing its aging fleet of Soviet-era Mi-35 helicopters with six Airbus H-145M attack helicopters by the end of 2024. The Barak MX system, along with the planned upgrades to Cyprus's military assets, underscores the nation's commitment to enhancing its defense capabilities amid ongoing regional tensions. The strategic significance of this acquisition extends beyond national defense. Cyprus shares security concerns with Greece, which is also modernizing its air defense systems. Discussions between the two countries have explored the possibility of joint procurement of air defense assets, including the Barak MX. Although the nations are currently pursuing separate acquisition strategies, the potential for future collaboration could lead to cost savings and improved interoperability. Greece has expressed its intent to create an integrated air defense network with Cyprus and Crete, a vision highlighted by Greek Defense Minister Nikos Dendias in a recent parliamentary presentation. The acquisition of the Barak MX system also reflects the broader regional defense dynamics in the eastern Mediterranean. Cyprus has been facing security challenges for decades, particularly since Turkey's invasion of the island in 1974, which led to its division. Tensions remain high due to territorial disputes and ongoing Turkish drilling in contested waters. Cyprus has expressed interest in NATO membership, but Turkey's military presence in northern Cyprus and its objections to the move have created significant barriers. The deployment of the Barak MX missile system contributes to strengthening Cyprus's air defense network, not only enhancing its own security but also bolstering regional stability. The system's compatibility with Greek defense assets could lead to a more cohesive and resilient defense structure in the region. Furthermore, the acquisition aligns with Cyprus's growing military cooperation with Israel, a key partner in addressing shared security challenges. The arrival of the Barak MX in Cyprus is expected to have geopolitical ramifications. It signals a growing military collaboration between Cyprus and Israel, two nations with shared security interests in the eastern Mediterranean. This partnership has the potential to shift regional power dynamics, particularly as Cyprus and Greece continue to navigate tensions with Turkey. The Barak MX's deployment represents a significant leap forward for Cyprus's air defense capabilities. It complements existing defense assets, such as the medium-range Buk M1-2 and short-range Tor M1 and Aspide systems, and enhances the National Guard's ability to defend Cyprus's airspace. By integrating this advanced missile system into its defense infrastructure, Cyprus is positioning itself as a more formidable force in the region, with improved capabilities to respond to evolving threats. In conclusion, the Barak MX acquisition marks a pivotal moment in Cyprus's defense modernization. It strengthens the nation's air defense infrastructure, contributes to regional security, and signals a growing alignment with Israel. As Cyprus continues to enhance its military capabilities, the Barak MX system will play a crucial role in ensuring the island's security in a rapidly changing geopolitical landscape.